At six tonight, Kentucky is getting millions of dollars back from an investment that has since been called a con job. WDRB investigators Travis Ragsdale and Chris Otts have been on watchdog duty for years with Brady Industries. WDRB has kept an eye on this investment and what was Brady Industries for years. Now, five years after that initial investment, Kentucky is getting its money back. Brady Industries was hailed at the time of its announcement as a savior for a part of eastern Kentucky near Ashland. The company promised to build a $1.7 billion aluminum mill that would employ 600 workers. The state, under the direction of former Governor Matt Bevin, pledged $15 million to the effort. But soon, questions were raised about the company's CEO and president, Craig Bruchard, and if he could get the money needed to build the plant in time. In a 2019 interview, Bouchard told WDRB that the company was close to having the money, but that proved to be untrue. Now, because of the promise that went unfulfilled, Kentucky has been able to get back its $15 million. Not only have we resecured that $15 million, but we are in the process uh, for um, the, the Northeast Kentucky Regional Industrial Authority of resecuring all the property. Uh, that was conveyed to or being used by the Brady Project. Bouchard was forced down as CEO after accusations that he misused company money. The company has since been absorbed and has abandoned any plans for the original site. By the way, Bouchard is now the co-chairman of a company called Space Railway that claims it will build a monorail into outer space. Travis Ragsdale, WDRB News.